Brendan Fraser reveals why Tom Cruise's The Mummy flopped, says he's open to revisiting the role. Brendan Fraser revealed he'd consider returning to the Mummy film franchise on one condition. Fraser opened up about his return to acting in a new interview. He recently starred in The Whale and has a role in the upcoming Martin Scorsese film Killers of the Flower Moon. Despite the new roles, the actor said he'd consider revisiting the character of Rick O'Connell in the Mummy franchise. I don't know how it would work, Fraser told Variety. But I'd be open to it, if someone came up with the right concept. Fraser appeared in The Mummy in 1999. He reprised his role with The Mummy Returns in 2001 and The Mummy, Tomb of the Dragon Emperor in 2008. In 2017, Tom Cruise attempted his own version of The Mummy, which ended up being a box office flop. It is hard to make that movie, Fraser noted. The ingredient that we had going for our Mummy, which I didn't see in the new one, was fun. That was what was lacking in that incarnation. It was too much of a straight-ahead horror movie. The Mummy should be a thrill ride, but not terrifying and scary. Fraser has largely stayed out of the spotlight after addressing physical ailments due to performing many of his own stunts on screen. The actor has also been outspoken about his struggle with depression after an alleged sexual assault incident in 2003. In 2018, Fraser claimed that he was sexually assaulted by former Hollywood Foreign Press Association President Philip Burke in 2003. The actor also alleged that the incident contributed to the downfall of his career. I became depressed, Fraser told GQ at the time. I was blaming myself and I was miserable, because I was saying, this is nothing, this guy reached around and he copped a feel. Work withered on the vine for me. In my mind, at least, something had been taken away from me. Burke denied the allegations, although he wrote about the incident in his 2014 memoir, claiming he pinched Fraser's backside, in jest. Fraser is returning to the silver screen for what many believe could be an Oscar-contending role as Charlie, a 600-pound gay man who feels as though his life is coming to an end, in The Whale. The role represents a major comeback for Fraser's career as it is his first leading role in almost a decade. The Crash star said he enjoys being back in demand. I was never that far away, Fraser told Variety. You can't get rid of me that easy. But I'm glad to have a job. I'm still expecting somebody to walk over to me, hand me a dish towel and say, Fraser, get back in the kitchen.